I'd like to record this video for all the young stars I see out there. Um, I see them, um, you know, slicing their soul and putting marks on their wrists and everything. Well, I'd like to give you a demonstration. It's called the radial artery. The human anatomy, the radial artery, is a main blood vessel with oxygenated blood of the lateral aspect of the forearm. The radial artery arises from the bifurcation of the brachial artery and the cubital fossa. It runs distantly on the anterior part of the forearm. There it serves as a landmark for the division between the anterior and posterior compartments of the forearm, with the posterior compartment beginning just lateral to the artery. The artery winds laterally around the wrist, passing through the anatomical snuff box and between the heads of the first dorsal and teresius muscle. It passes anteriorly between the heads of the adductor polycius and becomes the deep palmar arc, which joins with the deep branch of the ulnar artery. Along its course, it is accompanied by the similarly named vein, the radial vein. In the forearm, at the wrist, Dorsal carpal branch of radial artery, a small vessel which arises beneath the exterior tendons of the thumb. First dorsal metacarpal artery, arises just before the radial artery passes between the two heads of the first dorsal intercosius muscle and divides almost immediate into two branches which supply the adjacent sides of the thumb and index finger. The lateral side of the thumb receives a branch directly from the radial artery. Okay, well... Take this into instance. Um, you take your hand right at this point and find it hard to breathe. You find yourself extremely stressed. Well, you see, you see people cutting yourself because they think that it's a relief to them. You see, cutting yourself is not the relief. That's not what that's that's not what's helping you guys, man. I'm telling you, I'm trying to I'm trying to help you guys out there. Okay. Um, there's people in the world that will do things to you that you have no idea of what's going on to you. Um, trust me, if you listen, you'll learn. This is your left hand. If you just take your finger and press on your left artery, it instantly makes you want to burp. Not to mention, it instantly makes you want to breathe. So for instance, if you were to take a bandana and tie it around it tightly, or if you were to take your pinky finger or this, or even pinch yourself, <clears throat> it instantly makes you want to burp. You see, that, my friend, is why I got this tattoo to remind me. Remember, just press in the vein, the main vein, right where the wrist is at, there's going to be a little vessel. Press it. Instantly makes you want to burp. Pinch yourself. Because if you cut yourself, people are going to use it against you. Not to mention it's not good for you and you can get nasty stuff inside of your wound. Just poke yourself. Poke yourself. Not with syringes or needles or heroin or drugs. Just press in your arm and it'll make your breathing better. This is for the twins. I see you guys doing that stuff to yourself all the time.